the way income tax is actually calculated is not that when you get moved into a new income tax bracket, that is now the percent income tax that you pay for your whole income. Everyone, rich or poor, pays 10% on the first $9,275. And then they pay 15% on the amount between 9275 and up to 37,650. They still only pay 10% on the first 9,275. If they're fortunate enough to make more than 37,650, then the amount over 37,650 but less than 91,150 they pay 25% increase on, 25% tax. Now these numbers are to save us the trouble of having to go back and calculate what 10% of 9275 is. It's 927.50, right? And then 15% of the amount between 37650 and 91150 plus the 927.50 would result in a tax on income over 91,150 being 31 or between 37,000 and 91,000 to round it off is this much tax from this part and this part and then plus 25% of the amount over the 37,650. So in this case, they want us to use the table to calculate the income tax due on a taxable income of $260,000. Okay, that's gonna be right in this category, right? So the tax on $260,000 is $46,278.50. Plus 33% of the amount over 37,650. No, I'm sorry, I'm looking down here. Of the amount over 190,150. That amount over would be 260,000 minus 19150. So this is all you have to do to calculate the tax. It's 46, 278.75 plus 0.33 times 69,850. That's the difference here. So they're only paying 33% on this amount. That amounts to $2,305, oh wait, there's another zero in there, $23,050 and 50 cents. Thought they were getting away kind of cheap. And those all in all add up to 69,329 and 25 cents. But now you, before you feel really, really sorry for this person, keep in mind that that leaves them $190,670.75 to get by on. I think they can handle it.